Hello, awesome, epic final bow fights! I'm Winter and this is Super Float Adventures, where I left in the middle of making a spawner trap, which is working really badly right now. <laughs> uh, I should make it a tiny bit larger, it's supposed to be a square thingy. Also, I should make it a tiny bit deeper too, for efficiency's sake. Uh, no, I think this is fine. Mobs should not get stuck behind the spawner. Or should I? No, I think they do. Yeah, I think they're going to pump their hearts. <laughs> it's ridiculous. What we're trying to do here is, uh, once they take off all the torches, the skeletons are going to spawn in the water. They're going to get stuck behind here because I'm an idiot. But then they're going to keep going all the way down here. And then since mobs jump in water, they're going to start going upward. And eventually they're just going to take fall damage once they make them fall from somewhere. Ooh, this is not a tutorial, so I'm going to mess it up because that's how it works. Now, uh, uh, I can never remember how many signs and things are supposed to be here. <laughs> uh, I think they need to fall for, to fall for 20 something blocks. Uh, in, in this case, uh, I'm not making this. My signs are all the way down. Gaboosh. <laughs> Great start. In my case, I'm not trying to make a trap that actually is going to give me experience as well. Lots of spaces. L let me out of here. I just need a drop. So if the skeletons die when they hit the ground, it's... I, I don't care. It's not going to be an issue for me at all. How many signs did I craft at the beginning? I have no idea. <laughs> Let's make this a tiny bit taller. Uh, I think I'll make the thing go that way. I need one sign here. And I need another one up there if I can reach. Yes, I can. Skaboosh, skaboosh, and pam. Oh, oh, darn. Nah, nah. I've done it. In the meantime, I have been looking up a couple of things recently out of curiosity and a tiny bit of interest that then kind of faded away when I realized I couldn't really do it but you know I'm always trying to to improve how I do things up oh, well I should totally close this before placing the water uh, yeah, let's put it here and the water's going to spill but I'm going to do this and then BAM I always try to make videos that look better and better, video after video, which doesn't necessarily work. <laughs> uh, I always try to mess with the settings or try out new things and stuff. And real life works like that too. I keep trying new things and eventually whatever works I'm going to keep doing it. Sweet! And well... Recently, I have gotten an interest in voice acting, not in a professional way, really, just the concept of it. After all, when you think about it, it it's not that far from what I'm already doing. I mean, you, you, you're... well, it, not really, <laughs> I take it back. It's something that has to do with... Uh, with your voice and with the way you use it, uh, but in one case you're just uh, reading lines uh, from a script. Uh, well, in well, well, let's playing. I have to improvise. There are two different things, but still, they're still about recording my voice. And I thought uh, if I could do one, maybe I could do the other. I looked it up a bit. Uh, wonder what to do. How I could uh, put my wonderful voice to good use. <laughs> and then I kind of gave up on it when I realized I really couldn't do it in a... I really couldn't do any sort of voice acting in a... In a decent way. Maybe we should make some pants or something. Yeah, whatever. Because I don't really have the equipment for it. Uh, a headset microphone is really not the best... Uh, thing and yeah I currently can't really afford to do anything about it but still I just looked it up I just 
just looked it up. I need blocks. Uh, I wondered uh, what uh, could be what you're supposed to do to do good voice acting and things like that. It's something that I had thought of. Uh, oh, this is the wrong place. Yeah, I'll leave it there. <laughs> ah, okay, we're going. I'll pick you. I pick you up later. Something that I have, mm, it just uh, hit me because it's common knowledge, and yet I kind of had not uh, thought about it. When people do voice acting. Uh, they have, you know, a microphone. <laughs> but you did not expect that out, did you? Uh, <laughs> and stuff, and they are standing. When voice actors record their own voices for whatever, for a video game, for I don't know, they, they, they're standing when they do that. Uh, and there's a good reason for that. Uh, when you're standing, that was laggy. <laughs> You get the most out of your voice. Uh, it's just going to be... Let's test it. Let's see. There it goes. Oh, that's perfect. I didn't even count how many blocks I had placed. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's just more powerful, more clear. It's just something that... It's just the way you're supposed to do it. When you're recording your own voice, you're supposed to be standing. When you're singing, when you're whatever, y you need to be standing on your two legs. Or one if you had a terrible accident one day in your life. But... Yep. So as I was... I don't look at you. As I was looking up all of these wonderful things, uh, and I was wondering if I couldn't use any of the tips people gave for a good voice acting to improve my YouTube channel for the purpose of uh, Let's Playing. I decided, I mean, if I know there's a way I can improve the way I do my videos, the quality of my videos, it would be a sin not to do it. Uh, oh yeah, there was a hole here. If I know there's something else uh, I can do to produce better videos, I have to do it. Uh, it's... It's a moral thing. It, it can't not be there and I can't do worse videos than I could on purpose. It's it's a like it's a thing of mine. Uh I think people whatever they're doing if they're I don't know for a hobby or really anything, people in general, the smart people are those who make the most out of what they have. I think that's how life should work. I mean, I really don't have the tools to make really professional videos, but I have to make the best of what I do have. So if I can't, uh, if I can't record videos in crazy HD quality, just because my computer can really manage to to do that, uh, it's not my fault. But if I on purpose, don't do something even though I could afford to, then no, that is that is bad. So, now that I know that to get the most out of my voice I have to be standing, this is how I will record my videos from this day onward. I will play video games while standing, <laughs> while standing and uh, having to lean down to kind of see the screen and uh, reach for my keyboard. I think I need to put my keyboard higher up. Here we go. Now now that's better and my mouse too. Here it is. I'm going to look at Enderman by accident while I move this. My bottle is on my screen here. Don't move that. There we go. Now this is real. This is how quality is made. This is how the pros do it. This is how you're supposed to do things. This is, this is it. This is the secret. This is the only thing I've been missing so far, but now, now, this is the pro league. I mean, wow, just, just, can you, can you already hear the change in my voice? Can you hear now how much better it sounds? That's just amazing. Listen to my voice, just how pure and powerful and wonderful it sounds. It's so beautiful. I'm going to sit down now. <laughs> 
That is really ridiculous. <laughs> but it would be a nice Minecraft challenge. Defeat the Ender Dragon while standing. <laughs> ah, so, this, this is a little silly thing I was thinking of. Uh, yeah, it's true. It's true that you're supposed to be standing while you're recording your own voice, but clearly let's plays are an exception because <laughs> you're playing video games at the same time and you're supposed to look at the screen which is if it's on a desk then it's definitely not uh, at uh, your height uh, when you're standing and so yeah th that was just a silly thing i was thinking of lighting is really slow today for whatever reason Ooh, spooky so uh i don't know how tall this is so i need to test it uh, and to test it, I need to throw myself down and think, unless I... Well, I really, as I mentioned, I really don't want to die in this thing, in this LP. So, I don't think I'll do that. I should have just counted. But yeah, let me get up there. I need to close it. I'll just test it with skeletons. I mean, I already have test subjects. I don't see why I should not be using them. This is, now you, you can't uh, deny it, this is the most fabulous trap, uh, spawner trap you have ever seen. Just look at this, oh, look at this beauty. It's wonderful. This is the part where I realized that I did things wrong. I was supposed to put a sign here and then dig here. I think this works too. Except mobs are going to try jumping? I don't think so. If I put this here, they won't be jumping. And I need to close it here too. I don't think they can escape. Oh, no! No, 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 no! I just said I didn't want to test it myself! <laughs> Get that back. I am still out of torches, so once I'm done with this, uh, I am going to go mineshaft exploring. Because I really need to find chests. Uh, with um, with coal in them. I really need this. Okay, so skeletons can't jump from here. I can just leave it open and whatever. I hope no Enderman spawn here. They probably will. Never mind. So we wee! That's the sound of a person falling from uh, from a whole pile of wool. Yeah, I think I'll test this. Oh wait, I can't jump down there. Or I won't be able to close it back. But yes, here we are. Down here. I guess I'll test it now. Need to close this. Uh, need to make sure that everything is well lit. Because it's not. I need a torch here. That's why I got it before. And I need to close this. Because these skellies are going to kick my face if I don't do that. Uh, this is good. This is decent. So the skeletons are going to fall here. I took uh, a whole bunch of fall damage. And I think I should be able to activate the spawner from down here, actually, but I did not count the blocks. Uh, if not, I will have to move this thing. I, I mean, the thing up there, I need to move it so it comes like more like here. Oh yeah, testing time! I need to take this torch. Um, oh wait, this torch here is going to... Are there torches here? Oh, I need to close this too. Better. I think that's it. <laughs> I think I've done it. I need to eat a piece of bread that I can't eat Well, I'm in the water. I'm going to be brought away from the currents. There. No, 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 crap! <laughs> yeah, well, oh, it didn't work out. Give me that. Things are probably going to spawn right now in my face. Give me that. And give me that. Hello, Mr. Scout. Blah, blah. Uh-oh. 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 Oh. 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 I think there is another torch somewhere that I did not see. Freak, where did I put it? Uh, let me break this. Seriously, uh, there is an extra torch somewhere in there. Oh crap, it's all the way up there. Can't reach it! <laughs> Gosh darn it. Hello, Mrs. Kelly. Nah, I still can't reach it. This is silly! I just need a torch! Give me the torch! Ah! It's so close! Go away, you! 
got it! Yes! Uh, I've got it! Now I need to place back this torch, otherwise uh, stuff is going to spawn here and I don't want stuff to be spawning here. Now let's go all the way over here. Oh yeah! You <laughs> I was wondering when these guys would start falling, so they're not dying. They're still not dying. This thing definitely needs to be way deeper or taller. I could just uh, kill them with bows, I suppose, since I have an infinite amount of arrows right now. But no, I'll make this thing a bit, uh, a bit taller and deeper. Hmm. Are things spawning? I think they are. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, they're definitely not taking enough damage here. Uh, let's see how deep I need to make it. Well, deep, taller, because I plan on changing the thing up there. Let's not allow them, however, to get in here. <laughs> like, which, that would be a bad idea. Hello? Hello, good sir. I'm almost reaching the... The bottom layer here. In a moment, they're going to be falling in the void rightly. Why do we find it hilarious? I don't know why you find it hilarious. Alright, you're going to die. Oh! Ah, well, uh, that was a sword, at least, so never mind. Let's wait for things to fall. Hopefully, I'm activating the spawn raven from all the way down here. But yeah, so the, the, the standing while recording my voice thing, it was, of course, a joke. Uh, but I did get a couple of nice tips uh, for stuff, uh, and maybe I can put them to good use. More bows. Okay, I need to. Oh, oh, enchanted bow. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, we need to fix this now. I'll just leave you there. I need to place a torch back. I think if I place it on the spawner, it should be enough. Probably not, actually. But there's not much I can do about it. Let's get down here. I ain't run out of bread, so this is the part where I will have to start surviving on watermelons. Which is kind of annoying because their saturation thing... They, they, they give back very little saturation, so you have to constantly be eating them, and that's annoying. Also... Oh yeah, I have an entire stack. Well, th I think I'll plant some more, just to be sure. Do I have... yes. The water... yes, it should be able to get all the way down here. So, I'll put these here. That was a leg spike. Place it down! Oh, no, it's enough light. My fault, my bad. I lost lots of seas right now. <laughs> Um, yeah, my torch situation is really bad. Oh crap, yeah, they keep... This should help. Oh, let's put it up here. Hopefully. Let's see. How are you doing? Is there enough light for you, little guys? No, there's not enough light over here. But... Uh... This should do. Wait, Tosh is not centered. Now there should be enough light for all of you. Are you going to pop out? No, the, these seeds just do not want to be there. <laughs> Aww, poor mel watermelon seed. Or are they? I don't know if the plant is going to pop out uh, if it's already grown. Hmm. I will admit my ignorance here. Please this, please this. Honestly, I don't like the way the bone meal now works. <laughs> but I suppose it was a tiny bit overpowered before, so I can understand the reasoning. Well, overpowered. It's food. <laughs> There's plenty of ways to get food, but... Ah... Uh... Eh. No, 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 I heard the skeleton falling because I am activating the spawner from over here, right? So I need to get it from... No, I need wool first. I need to get wool. What is left to say? 
I I totally ran out of time. I was planning on uh, finishing uh, the spawner in, in one episode, but I didn't. <laughs> so I, I guess I'll finish it next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself. And indeed, we will keep working on the spawner next time.